It's my feel-good breakfast show. As your natural journey unfolds, let our products naturally assist you. Salome, your journey matters. Available at pharmacies nationwide. Now, getting the inside scoop on the symptoms women face during menstruation from industry professionals is the talk of the day. And today, we take a deep dive into what PMS is and the symptoms that come part of the parcel. And joining us to discuss PMS and how it affects your life is Dr. Shavit Sachs. Good morning, doctor. Hi, good morning. Thank you so much. Oh, this is a very important conversation, but let's start at the beginning. Tell us a little bit more about what PMS exactly is. Absolutely. So PMS is a constellation of physical and behavioral symptoms that occur before your period. It's about seven to 14 days before. Um, and these are usually troublesome enough to interfere with your daily life. And despite it being very common, it's pushed aside. It's not given as much attention when it is um, presented in practice. Well, you know, let's give it some attention because what are some of the causes and the most common effects of PMS that women can experience? So the causes of PMS can be super widespread. It can be hormonal factors, hereditary factors, uh, potentially fluid electrolyte imbalances, inflammatory factors, psychological factors, and vitamin and mineral deficiencies. And um, PMS is usually classified into four categories, or at least as a naturopath, we were taught that it is classified into four categories. You get PMS A, which is your irritability, your anxiousness, your mood swings, PMSC, which is your carbohydrate cravings, your increase in appetite, headaches, heart palpitations, PMSD, which is your depression, your low mood, low self-esteem, and PMSH, hyperhydration, which is when you have weight gain and during your period, breast tenderness, swelling, and bloating. Well, I feel like you've just touched on what the physical and the emotional symptoms are that women experience during PMS. Does everyone experience this? No. That's a, a great myth, actually, that everyone experiences PMS. Not all menstruators experience PMS. It is because of an, uh, an hormonal imbalance that's happening. So mm -hmm. if, you are norm if your hormones are regulated, your body's normalized, you won't experience PMS symptoms. Now, can we unpack what some of the most common myths are associated with PMS? The first, and I think the most important, is that it is normal that nothing can be done about it and that it isn't a big deal. And none of that is true. You know, in practice as a naturopath, I'm gonna look at um, hormonal normalization, what's happening in the hypothalamic pituitary ovarian axis. So that's your hormonal reproductive axis. How can we normalize that? Or can we address lifestyle factors, dietary factors? What are the inflammatory levels that are happening? But PMS is not normal. And there's so much that can be done about it. And it is a big deal. Make a hurrah about it to your practitioners. I love that you say make a hurrah about it because, you know, so often people just saying, oh, she's just PMSing. Meanwhile, it's not normal. So thank you for saying that, doctor. For sure. <laughs> and if you at home haven't already, share this information with your friends and your family. Expert advice like a helping hand on your journey. And with Salome, your journey matters. On a monthly basis, all of us powerful, fierce women deal with our menstrual cycle. But why let it affect our lives? Anywhere I go, anywhere I be. As your natural journey unfolds, let our products naturally assist you. Live your full, unfiltered life with the Salome range. For PMS, menstrual pain, and heavy menstrual bleeding. Salome, your journey matters. Available at pharmacies nationwide.